Howlers were furred creatures native to the extragalactic planet of Peridia, and they could be tamed and ridden, and they would respond to commands and acted more like a dog than a wolf. But they were large and fast, and could travel long distances when ridden while carrying light packs as well, and they were also extremely loyal in protecting any rider. Howlers were also ridden by a group of bandits that resided on Peridia, but even Ezra was surprised Sabine had a howler, implying that he couldn't or that they were difficult to tame. We haven't seen any wild but only domesticated howlers on Peridia, but they're a cool rideable wolf-like species on the, like I said, extra galactic planet of Peridia. A nice new addition and mount to the Star Wars universe, and I wonder if any of these live on any other planets that we are familiar with, or if they're only located on Peridia. Sabine's howlers seemed to be a bit more friendly once you got past the initial growls and snares, implying that they do have a bit more of a personality and again acted more like a dog than a wolf. But that is the Howler, new addition to the Star Wars universe and one of the first creatures seen on Peridia. Subscribe if you would like and until next video, goodbye.